Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back to Sita's Budgeting Journey. I'm Maria, aka Sita, and on my channel I'll be cash stuffing envelopes, completing fun savings challenges, and I will also document my journey towards financial freedom. So if any of this interests you, please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell so you don't miss any uploads as I navigate my way towards a debt-free life and learn to budget for my future. <laughs> Alrighty guys, y'all already know I am back for day seven. Like I said yesterday, these days are just rolling by super, super fast. I hope you guys are having enough time to get things done because man, time is going by fast. I'm sorry for my uh, wrinkled sweater in case you guys notice. Yes, I am a hot mess today. I'm tired. Jaden was very sick last night and I'm just not getting better. I think it's really finally taking its toll and I'm cold. It's freezing. The kids are talking about they're hot. So I just grabbed a sweater and yeah, it's, it's wrinkled, but <laughs> I'm, you know, I'm trying. And, um, today to, you know what? I forgot. I knew, you know what? I took NyQuil last night, but I took it like in the wee morning hours and I'm still tired and groggy from it. So I forgot to post on my community page and share with you who I was highlighting today. Guys, I found a newer YouTuber. I want to say she's been around maybe seven months, I think. Um, <clears throat> her name is McKay, which is so pretty. I love that name. And her channel name is Collective Echo. Now she is a wife and guys, a bonus mom of five. I think that is such a blessing. I love when people, you know, refer to their stepchildren as bonus kids or as their own kids. I think that is so sweet. Um, <clears throat> another thing about her, I'm going to post again. Her information above you guys will probably see it about now and um another thing that she did and i found on her channel was one actually one of the first videos i saw she did an intro video which i think was so cool now i know there's been a few youtubers who do, do that and they speak a little about themselves in their first video i think if i'm not mistaken i did that on my very first video but I think it was so cool that she did a whole video and it was a, you know, introduction to herself. So if you guys do go check out her channel, scroll down a little bit, maybe about, I don't know, seven months ago and check out that video. Um, if not, like I said, I'll link that video for her. Uh, her channel page again is Collective Echo. Her budget, her channel is primarily about budgeting, but she is a reseller. And she speaks a little bit about that in her um, intro video. So go check her out, guys. You guys are going to really, really like her channel. I know I say that about everybody because, you know what, we're all great. We are all a part of this budgeting community. And everybody brings something different to the table. So something that I might do, someone else may learn from, and vice versa. And it might be someone who's only been budgeting for a couple of weeks or someone who's been doing it for years. We all do things differently and that's the beauty of this community. And the fact that everyone is willing to share their budgeting journey, their experiences, their mistakes, their wins. Listen, like I always say, I'm here for it. All right, guys, let's go on to stuffing our Christmas challenge for today, day seven. <clears throat> excuse me and guys the next thing i'm going to work on and i'll hopefully be posting it tomorrow will be my bi-weekly budget breakdown hopefully that's going to be my video for tomorrow if not definitely by saturday and then next week i'm excited because i will be cash stuffing yay i miss it and i'm also going to be working on my mini savings challenges and oh my savings binder because I am going to, when I do my sinking funds, I switched over my most of my family envelopes and actually all of my family envelopes and my emergency fund into this beautiful binder. So we'll be filling this one in next week. All right, guys, so we are on day seven. How exciting is that? 
Right. So let's see. Five, six, seven. And let's count it and see what we have today. So we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. Would you look at that? You know, it's funny. I didn't think I was going to do this every day because I was like, I don't know if I'm going to have the money. But it's so easy. You know, when you think about a dollar, two dollars, three dollars, I've actually had no problems because I had the money. Um so hopefully I'll be able to complete this within the 12 days of Christmas and then the $78 guys I'm going to allocate it towards my self-care binder because Maria needs a little love <laughs> and um yeah I was thinking about you know what I'm gonna use this money for Christmas gifts or I'm gonna use it to buy myself something but there's nothing in particular that I want right now so I'm going to Add the $78 to my savings binder. No, not to my savings binder. I am going to add the $78 to my self-care binder. Yes. And then I'll figure out what to do. Maybe get some more tea and honey. <laughs> Man, I've never drank so much tea in my life. And soup. And uh, I guess, it, you know, this too shall pass. It is cold actually i'm cold so because the kids like i said they're saying they're not cold but i'm i'm really cold um it was snowing today guys snowing uh-uh we don't want no snow it's been it's been snowing regularly for about a good two hours thank god it's not sticking i for one love to see it fall it's so pretty and when it you know everything's all nice and white and but the next day or the following day it becomes a mess and slush during the day ice in the early mornings mm -mm. no we don't want that all right guys i hope you are having a great day i hope that um <clears throat> you guys are looking forward to the weekend and um be blessed y'all be blessed check on your loved ones it is getting cold not everywhere of course because some of y'all have beautiful weather but where it's cold guys check on check on your loved ones you know make sure that they don't have you know any needs maybe if you need to run to the store for them <clears throat> they need to pick up medicine you know whatever the case may be but but check on check on your loved ones especially the elderly all right guys have a wonderful day we will be chatting again tomorrow Thank <laughs> you.